I am playing today at the gorgeous Defence Raya Golf and Country Club in Lahore, Pakistan. I am going to play the front nine, playing about 3,170 yards. This is a video showing you what a nine handicap player plays like every single shot. I hope you enjoy the video. With bunkers on the right, I was just trying to avoid them. I didn't catch the center of the driver, but I'm in the fairway, happy to start with. I'm usually very comfortable hitting my eight iron, and I thought I got this well, but uh, found myself a little short of the green. I chipped this exactly where I wanted to be, however the ball didn't roll through and I left myself a long putt. This was a bit of a misread actually, my power putt. I thought it will come from the left but it actually went straight. So this I am going to clear for a bogey and I am happy with the start. I am not the longest driver of the ball on a par 5 to try to go to one, but finding myself in the fairway is good enough. Even though this hybrid was quite a miss hit, hit it clean, but I crossed the water, got a good roll uh, near the green. I short sighted myself with that chip, it was 65 yards, but I don't think I hit more than 50. I have a long uphill putt. This was a long uphill daunting putt, which I unfortunately overcooked. <laughs> Desperate for a par, I smacked this center. Thankfully, it went in and I secured my first par of the day. On shorter par fours, I prefer hitting my three wood for more control. As you can see there, I smacked that drive, avoiding the hazard on the right and the bunkers on the left, leaving myself a very short approach shot, uh, which I did not hit as well as I wanted to. But since I was far ahead in the fairway, I managed to get a good connection and secure myself a birdie butt which I unfortunately underread, but I think it was lacking for pace as well. Anyway, tap in, stressless par on hole number three, um, going good. On to a long par three, about 220 yards. I got a good center hit of the club, however, it drew a little too much. I did cross the bunkers, leaving myself this chip with a lot of mud on the ball. However, it actually helped me. I was nervous how it'll react. It stopped the ball leaving me this short par putt which I completely missed, didn't realize how fast the green was, leaving myself this bogey putt which I will hopefully make. On to another par 5 with OB on the right and bunkers on the left. I was happy with that shot, got the center of the fairway, leaving myself a good chance. It was too far to go to on so I was just wanting to get about a hundred shot left but I pulled that slightly going into the bunker I was quite annoyed by that shot actually because I left myself quite a difficult shot on the green 170 almost and I smacked that seven iron so well I was so happy with that shot compensating for the previous one but look at this putt it was a very long putt I hit it almost half of the green to the flag and I love how the ball rolled towards the green, leaving myself a very, very easy, almost tap in putt for par. So another par four, index three. I feel like I've been hitting the driver really well today. And that's another solid driver shot to the center fairway, avoiding the trees on the left and the bunkers on the right. This shot is actually more difficult than it looks because you've got hazard right in front of you and bunkers on the right and I unfortunately did take pressure on that shot and sort of miss hit and miss the green leaving this awkward chip for myself confused between a putter and a chip I hit a good chip actually uh, leaving myself a decent shot par putt which I would always back myself to make but today the putting has been off you can see the slumped shoulders. I've made another bogey. The par threes at this course are difficult. They're long with hazards in play. And I'm hitting my three hybrid again for about 210 yard shot. And I was so happy with that connection. Straight at the flag, 
but unfortunately it went a little over. You can see the disappointment because I thought I'll have a birdie butt, but I left myself this terrible chip, which trying to loft it, I hit it clean, leaving myself a long putt going back of the green. So this is an uphill putt onto the green. It seems so useless going over and then under the green, but the putt was a decent one, leaving myself, however, a tricky uh, bogey butt because uh, it undulates a lot from here. So I was a little unhappy with it overall, but uh, managed to clean it up with a good butt, made a bogey, yet another one actually. A little disappointing with the first shot, but I'll take it. Still frustrated with the previous hole, we were on to a shorter par 4, which I desperately wanted to play well. You can see the disappointment and the eagerness both to just moving away after the shot, leaving myself just about a 100 yards short. I wanted to attack directly the flag, but unfortunately it went a little right, leaving me a longer birdie putt. And I saw the line, I thought I could make this, almost felt like it wouldn't go in, and then it drops. You can see the happiness in my body because of those bogeys. I was delighted to make a birdie. This is by far the toughest hole I've ever played. A long par four, dog leg right, hazard and OB on the right. A good driver is very important over here, which I did get. So good first shot like I've been getting all day today. But even after a good driver, you have such a long shot. I had about a 200 plus shot to the green, hitting my four iron, but I pulled it slightly like I've been doing my longer irons today, unfortunately, leaving myself a nasty little chip. Just look at that green. It's undulated, sloping downwards. I was hitting this just onto that slope in front, trying for it to come down from the right. And I just got it two yards shorter than where I wanted to, it to go. And you can see the difference in how far we are from the flag, leaving myself a long power putt. I saw the line, I had confidence in it, but it was just faster than I had to be. So I missed it. However, a tap in bogey putt on the most difficult hole. Overall, I was happy with this hole playing 40 over nine holes. Not bad for nine handicap player.